He said that they haven't asked for pictures. No one asked me for pictures. There are families of the workers missing from Impact Plastics. They continue to search for answers about the search for their loved ones. Those who disappeared and escaped floodwaters from the plant say they were not allowed to leave, even as the waters started to rise around them. Now, this is what the plant looks like today. One worker telling News 5 that while managers evacuated the plant, workers were told to stay behind. I said, can we leave? And the woman said, no, not until I speak with Jerry. About 10 minutes later, she came back and said, y'all can leave. It was too late. We had one way in, one way out. And when we told if we could leave, the one way out was blocked off. Impact Plastics released a statement on Monday about the plant evacuation. We reached back out to them again today to see if they wanted to respond to the workers' claims. They referred us back to the original statement from yesterday that said in part that bilingual managers delivered the message to leave the area to the non-English speaking employees and that most left immediately. Some remain for unknown reasons. You can read the entire statement on our homepage at WCYB.com.